Hi everyone, welcome back to my Sonic Kitchen and today I will show you the Rhythmic Multi Effect plugin Tantra 2 by DS Audio. What makes this plugin so special is that it converts any sound into a complex rhythmic progression with lots of movement and it does this very easily with its intuitive interface. Here you see Tantra 2 and Tantra 2 has four different sections that you can combine. The first one is the top bar and that is for your global settings. Here you see the second one and that are all the effects. Here in the middle you see your sequencer section and the last one is the master section. So here you have like uh, global settings that you can use. You can also scale the plugin if you want it smaller or bigger, you're able to do that over here. You can save your MIDI mapping and you can also load it. So you can use this plugin also with your MIDI controller. These are the presets that you can use and you can also make your own presets. This is for the overall playback speed of the plugin. There are two independent stereo layers in Tantra. So you have layer A and you have layer B and you can adjust the modulation per channel and you can combine it. So down here in the master section, you see layer A and layer B. You are able to blend them in, to put them on or off, and you can also pan them. So you can make a different kind of modulation on your left side and also on your right side. In this section, you can change the order of the effects. So you can do it like this. Over here, you can undo and redo your settings. And this one is a randomizer, so I can randomize all my settings over here. So I can do it like this. I got different kind of settings. So let's look at the effects. Here you have a filter and you are able to use different kinds of uh, filters. It's the same over here with the distortion section. You can choose different kinds of uh, distortion. Here's delayed, lo-fi section, flange or phaser, and here you have a glitch tool. Here in the middle you see the sequencer section. So you have eight independent multi-stage sequencers. And you can uh, use it as a step sequencer. I do this like this. You can just draw it in. You can also make randomizations. There's also different kind of presets uh, that you can use. There's also curve mode. And with the curve mode, I'm able to make slope curves in my sequence. So let's have a look at this. So I just can grab it and I can make round slope curves over here. How can you now use the sequence of modulation? So there are two possible ways. You can draw them in or you can use the matrix. So I open also up the matrix so that you see what happens. This is the first sequencer. I just click on here and I drag and drop it here now on my filter. And you see here already modulator one and what the destination is. With right click, I can make more depth or less depth. And this is for your modulation. So let's listen how this sounds. Down here you have also reverb that you can use and you can also use an equalizer. You have different routing options. So this is in parallel, but you can also go serial and there's a clipper and you have here a mix option. So if you still want something from the original sound, you are able to do that as well. I'm working now on a song and I have a few songs that I really want to give modulation with Tantra. I didn't use a lot of effects on the song so that you are able uh, to hear really the effects from the plugin. Over here you see a pad sound that I have. It sounds like this. I really like the sound, but I want to make a completely different sound out of it. So I duplicate it. Uh, I have Tantra done on 100% for full modulation. And this I can then blend in with the song. So let's listen to some presets. So 
where you can hear already what it does. This sounds really nice. This is also really interesting. So there are so many possibilities. So, but I go back to uh, ghosts uh, for the filtering. So I will use a little bit less resonance, like this. And now we blend it into the song. So you can hear already it gives really nice movement. Also in the background it makes it more alive. So let's go here and pets. Wow. That sounds awesome. This is also really nice. So you really can make this rhythm in the pet sound. Nice stutter effect. Great. You can use this also on drum sounds, so let's uh, listen to how that sounds. I have here my drum. Let's put Tanfa on, so you can hear already great modulation. So I'm going to leave it now on whispers and then I can blend it in into the song. This is the song without any modulation. And this is with... You already can hear that the song gets way more alive and way more interesting. And I really like that you can work so fast with this plugin. Let me know what you think of it in the comments and what else you find an exciting plugin to check out. I look forward to hearing from you and see you the next time. Mm -hmm.